Hello, my name's James. This is Autumn. Hey. And we're back. <laughs> so today we thought we would talk about the ocean. Oh. So during the pandemic, we decided we needed to take a visit to some water area. And that seems like a very stupid idea because everyone was thinking the same exact thing, apparently. Yes, yeah, so last year <laughs> now, we bought a small hard-sided camper because we thought we would do as safely as we could, take some trips that we could take. So we did some research prior to going in the area. We, of course, weren't sick when we left, and we made sure that the uh, travel advisories, we held to those and the distancing and everything else. Regardless of that, we decided to go to... Quinby, Virginia. Yes. Aha, never heard of it, right? Yeah, neither had we. <laughs> and it is dead smack in the middle between Ocean City, Maryland and Virginia Beach, Virginia. A beautiful area that no one's ever heard of and people really don't go to it's cool yeah it is cool it's near um antica acetique 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 island which has is famous for wild horses running around it is located on the delmarva peninsula which contains uh delaware maryland and virginia now it also, the Chesapeake Bay area is part of a watershed, which covers six states, which includes Pennsylvania, West Virginia, Virginia, Delaware, Maryland. It's a lot. So, it's a lot and we need to protect that area. We need to start taking better care of our land. So we had to cross the Chesapeake Bay Bridge, which is a man-made marvel to behold. It basically connects Eastern Maryland to Western Maryland, but it crosses the entire ocean. It's a four lane man-made bridge that raises way above the ocean. And it was amazing to drive across. It was pretty cool. Some consider it to be scary. I was fine. I was in the passenger seat. <laughs> That's true. So normally when we go on a trip, she, uh, navigates and I drive so I was driving across this area with a trailer and tow and it was still amazing it was a good time <laughs> it doesn't cross across the ocean it goes across the Chesapeake Bay by the way that's true Thanks. so looked like the ocean to me <laughs> Now we went to that particular area mostly because we wanted to stay away from people. Now you don't have to stay away from people just because of coronavirus. You can want to stay away from people because you don't like people. That's true. So we decided to do that. We went to a Thousand Trails campground, which was Virginia Landing. Yes. And it is right on the ocean. It was. I won't say they exactly have a beach because they really don't. No. But the campground itself was very clean, very nice. It was right on the ocean. We woke up to walk out to see the ocean itself. It was pretty amazing. It was beautiful. Yes. There was some wildlife. There was crabs that were lovely. We got to watch them dancing around to music. <laughs> We also decided to visit a couple of areas off-site, not Assateague because we figured it would be a little bit too populated, but we went down to uh, Kip Kipitopik. It's a state park in Virginia where they let pets right on the beach. Yes, that's true. And a beautiful area, giant beach. It wrapped all the way around the area you could see um, I guess abandoned ships that were parked in the area, uh, beautiful. The park itself was clean. 
We had uh, lunch there. Our dogs enjoyed the ocean water. <laughs> Mostly. Sora. Mostly. No, Sora. they did. They did. Yeah. Uh, then that night we went on a kayak tour using Southeast Expeditions, which was a really good time. It was a bunch of kids trying to make it in a crazy world, and they had a good time with it. We had a good time with it. Yes, they were very knowledgeable, very friendly. They gave us pointers. We were both stuck in a kayak on the Bay Area. I've never been in a kayak before. <laughs> I, I've been kayaking a few times. Um, we went out on the ocean. They took us to a sandbar, and from there we got to watch the sunset, and they did some fireworks. It was beautiful and amazing and highly recommended. Recommend. <laughs> yes. Uh, so that was out of Port Charles, Virginia. And it was probably a beautiful town that we didn't actually go see because we didn't want to see any people because Corona. Like John Lennon said, life happens while you're busy making plans. So instead of making plans, go enjoy life. Just do it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. That's it for us. If you subscribed, you're awesome. If you watch this video to the to the end, you're amazing. Thank you guys. Have a great night. Bye. Bye.